Yo, this is Deontay the Bronze Bummer Wild, the WBC heavyweight champion of the world. And I'd like to give a big shout out to CJ Goodfellow, Sports TV. Bomb Squad, baby. All right, man. Uh, they already ready to protect the new way from Stephen Fulton, and I'm a huge uh, fan of both. Um, we was in the comment section yesterday, and obviously they was hating on Devin Haney. You're gonna see the live stream. Go watch it. And we started talking about Fulton just for a smidge of a time. And um, and I was like, well, I want to see Fulton take on the new way. He said, Why he can't take on Navarrete? Now let me tell you why he can't take on Navarrete real quick, uh, word for word. So. Uh, give me a minute. I pull this up. Uh, so this is a legit. Oh, nope, nope. Can't say something. Can't say nothing. Nope. So uh, I can't say that. So nonetheless, now Roddy probably going to be on pause for a second. Hopefully his situation gets uh, clear faster than, uh, you know, soon. So, um, but nonetheless, uh, he, he out for the while. A little bit, bro. I mean, he been off the grid, um, but like I said, the new way he fights uh, Tuesday, five thirty a.m., five thirty a.m. Um, in the morning. Okay, um, first on Neil Donier, I figure he get past Donier. He said Donier is the best fighter that that he fought. Um, but you know, at the end of the day, bro, people saying, well, why can't Foden, you know, move up and 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 take take on. Uh, and take on a man who never right there in the comment section yesterday. And my thing about that was, you know, why y'all ain't asking Stephen Fulton to go up there and take on Navarrete? You know, I mean, Brandon Figueroa to take on Navarrete. Brandon Figueroa already up there. Um, they both Mexican. And obviously, we do know the size of the streets. You know, Navarrete, you know, got a co-promotional deal with Zafner Boxing at top rank. You know, and Stephen Fulton over on the PBC side. So, you know, but if it's any type of fights that could get made, even with the new way fight, it's with the smaller fighter. So, like I said before, um, why can't Brandon Figueroa go fight, you know, Navarrete? He already, you know, he already, you know, um, already at, supposed to be debuting at 126. So, you know, at the end of the day, Foden's still at one at 122, uh, and he's looking to unify the division with MJ. Marjan Akadamadov, he's looking to uh, unify with him. Who got the other two belts? So it would make sense if they unified the winner of that fight, which it ain't no easy fight. I'm a fan of both of them, you know, uh fought in New Year Way because they both still at the weight. Oh no, nah, man, we don't want to see Fulton versus New Year Way. Why can't he take on Blase Blah and Blase this? And I'm just looking like, bro, I want to, you know, why not see that fight? You know, you're talking about uh, New Year Way could probably go up to 130 at least, 126. Well, let's see him take on uh Let's see him take on uh uh Foden, Foden or, or or MJ winner. What's wrong with that? That's not asking for too much at all. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, it's always a protection plan. You know what I'm saying? They always say, oh, he's boring, or he don't need it. Man, that'd be the ultimate test to see a new way take on. Um that'd be the ultimate test to see a new way take on Foden. See if that Japanese style can take on uh the black American slick style, you know. And he got he's a real technical fighter, he can punch too. So, and then the, the, the good thing about the fight is that uh Fold ain't the biggest puncher though, but he a big dude. You know what I'm saying? He a big dude, you know, but he ain't the biggest puncher, and that's a that's a scintillating um um matchup, you know. Can his defense? I mean, where would he fight a new way at? Would he, you know, try to stay on the outside? Could he get on the inside, walk him down? I know it's politics in that fight. But I'd be interested to see, you know, how New Way would take on that style because, you know, if you look at his uh his box rec, you know, if he's saying that a forty year old don't near the best fighter that he fought, and he did break his orbital bone, right? If he's saying that's the best fighter that he fought, bro, um, he gonna have some issues, man. Jason Maloney and he ain't on that level, and he very well could knock out Fulton because that motherfucker can crack. You know what I'm saying? He might, you know, get Fulton. I think he get Fulton the best fight. You know, Figueroa gave him a best fight, but he banged out Figueroa. was close. And eventually, they got to do it again, but he ain't fought nobody like that. He ain't fought, he ain't fought nobody like, uh, like, bro, if he was, excuse me, if he was at the division, my bad, if he was at the division, 
or move up. He didn't never fight nobody like him again unless he took on Rigan Dial. And you was expected to make a full recovery from a pressure cooking cooker busting in his face. So you think about it, you know, you look at his division. Was it bad and weight? Um really you know, maybe Gary Antonio Russell, you know, Rasheed Warren, uh, you know what I'm saying? So I mean it ain't too many dudes that that that's on that's gonna give you that perpetual movement style down there. I mean, you you know, you move up. You know, uh, Figueroa, he moved up, I heard. So, um, other than that, man, there ain't too many of them dudes that's going to give you that look. Now, you know, Figueroa, you know, or, you know, or Fulton would be a better matchup. Either or would be good versus uh, a New York way. Either or. Because Figueroa, man, he a fucking welterweight. He got a welterweight style. You know, but you know, anytime you give a new, I mean, either he gonna smother a new way and lay on him where he can't get him off of him, or uh, somebody made a video. Will he be great? That's punch, punish, drunk, drunk, box out the punch, drunk. You know, but uh, but yeah, you know, what I'm saying, he, can he keep Figaro off of him? I think he got enough power. I don't know, Figaro, man. If anybody could take his shot down there, it's probably Figueroa and keep coming. Do the welterweight, bro. So, um, different with Fulton, you know, he can fight many different styles, but he got a beard on him, but that dude cracking different, though. And then how's power going to translate moving up to 2022? 20, because every every fighter got their limit. You know, how's body going to feel and, and all that stuff, but you know, it's probably him hit figure in the new UA or voting in the new US. Probably two of the best matches you could, that can be made down there. Probably two, two of the best matches that can be made in the new UA is what he's 29, so he just turned 29. And Fulton is what 27, he 27. But I want to see how he deal with that, that slick style. He'd be 28 in July, so he's virtually damn near the same age, you know. He might have to go to Japan for that one, though. That's where all the money going to be yet. But it's a great, it's a great matchup. You already talking about, well, you know what? You know, why he, you know, uh, uh, why you got to fight him? You know, why you can't fight Navarrete? I mean, shit. He because Navarrete don't bring the money that Inouye bring. And it's a good matchup. If Inouye is as good as we think he is, well, shit, he should be competitive. You know what I'm saying? Down in that lower weight classes, you don't see dudes like folding like that, bro. So you get to go up there, bro, because they know folk gonna give them problems with this in and out movement. But the thing about it is, I mean, you know, a new year way a live dog, round the twelve, round one through twelve, and he can punch, you know. But then again, politics in the middle of that. And I ain't gonna let Fogan go over to Japan. He might. He might let him go over there, but that's a good fight, bro. I, you know, a new year way is the platinum standard for technique and boxing for the most part. Everything he do is very technical. You know, Fulton is just, you know, styling on slick, in and out, hand speed good, you know, range is good, fight you on the outside, fight you in the pocket, fight you on the inside, toss you, turn the IQ good. He just don't have a pop. The thing about it is he be fighting a smaller fighter too. So, you know, physically he, he you know, he's strong. So, you know, it's going to be a good fight. You know, we never thought you had Japan, Japanese style, taking on Philadelphia style, so I mean, that's the best fight that can be made under uh, 130 pounds, 90 pounds, 130 and below. It's the best fight that can be made. You know, in and a prime, it was just, whew. you know, and my, you know, Marjorie and Akadama, that's a good fight for both of them, too. Figaro and New York, that's a good fight. You know, Figaro and Fulton, too, that's a good fight. You know what I'm saying? But this is, this is the fight, you know, this is the fight to be made, bro. I want to see how New Way take on, you know, the, you know, the slick black style. That's the beautiful thing about it, you know, how Fulton deal with that thump. You know, he probably going to defuse him. You know, I think Fulton going to just keep making him pick it. Don't let him plant and hit the move. That's what I just do. I wouldn't even let him plant. You know what I'm saying? Every time, you know, every time he was set, I just move off the mark. <laughs> you know, don't let him get off. He one of them dudes I like to fight at his own pace. You know, you might have to back him up, bro. You might have to smother him. But it'd be interesting, especially Figueroa. That'd be interesting. Figueroa try to smother him. He get hit one of them goddamn either hand, you know. Can he keep coming? 
but uh maybe you know two hundred two hundred and twenty two pounds you know might be his his, his max i mean two hundred eighteen pounds might be his one hundred eighteen pounds might be his max but um yeah we have to wait and see so this time it'll be a three bell unification versus down there tomorrow at five thirty eastern standard time that'll be uh two thirty pacific standard time four thirty central standard time don't ask me how I know all of that. But I appreciate y'all, man. Let me know what you girls and guys think. Uh, thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. And the subscribe button is to the like icon button. Hit all notifications. Increase the and notifications. We go live and drop a video. If I'm Nancy, you want to support the channel, cash app, dollar sign, CJ Good 313 Venmo, CJ Good 313 PayPal link in the description. Man, other than that, man, hit my link tree. You can find me on Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, Spotify, Anchor, Cash App, YouTube, Venmo, PayPal. All information uh, in the link tree is the first link in the description. Appreciate the love and support. Uh, thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. Peace.